Another suspicious sighting on a popular lake in the Okanagan. The Calgary family actually spotted it, and lucky, luckily for us, they <laughs> caught it on video. It could be another glimpse of the elusive Ogopogo. It's got to be some sort of one-off fish that's just really long and likes to stick down low in the lake and then pops up every once in a while. But yeah, we took a picture by that the statue and I, I'd be sick if it looked like that, but I just, I guess I'm a bit of a realist. It was just off this pier at Friend Estate Winery in West Kelowna where Adam Schwartz and his family might have caught the elusive lake monster on camera. It was a really calm day and no, no boats were passing by or anything. So we were just kind of looking out on the water and then all of a sudden just saw kind of this there's just weird formation of waves that was kind of going against the current of what was coming in. It was just moving really weird and we'd obviously known about the, the great myth of the Ogopogo and we've been there growing up and I was always afraid of it. The Calgary family's fall visit is right at peak season to spot Ogopogo according to legend hunter oh, Bill Stasiak. If you go back over the years, uh, the majority of sightings of Ogopogo come in between the beginning of September into the middle of October. I've always said that if you wanted to get a picture, that's the time. Get it on the lake and get a camera. And you'll, you'll have your best shot. And he has an explanation of what the sighting could have been if it's not the elusive snake-like monster that is known around the world. Could be a thermal wave of some type. Uh, could also be just a light reflection off the actual crests of the waves. The sighting keeping the mystery of Ogopogo alive. Ogopogo has been a fixture, uh, a legend of, of, you know, Kelowna and, and the Okanagan Valley for oh, 150 years. If nobody believed in Ogopogo, why would they always be looking for it? The fact of it being a wave or the ridge of Ogopogo's back is now left up to the imagination and the guests of the viewer. Sydney Morton, Global News.